according to Pro Talk. In the film, Orr is adopted by the Tui family to protect him from living on the streets. Orr says he was never adopted by the family. Instead, he says the Tui tricked him into signing a document making them his conservators. This agreement allowed the Tui's to make business deals and profit off of Orr's name. The legal filing says the lie of Michael's adoption is one upon which co-conservatives Lee Ann Tuhi and Sean Tuhi have enriched themselves at the expense of their ward, the undersigned Michael Orr. Michael Orr discovered this lie to his chagrin and embarrassment in February of 2023 when he learned that the conservatorship to which he consented on the basis that doing so would make him a member of the Tuhi family provided him no familial relationship with the Tuhis. Orr says the Tuhi family used their power to turn his story into the blind side and then they allegedly received millions in royalties from the movie. Orr says he didn't get any money from any of that. Or his attorney says that he's deeply hurt by the situation with the Tui family. We haven't heard a response from the Tui family so far, but pretty ugly stuff 